What's up guys, it's Chris here. Coming back to you with another video. Um, today I'm gonna show y'all how to use the uh, desktop feature on your iPhone, so stay tuned. All right, now that we're back, um, this works, uh, should work on any, uh, on, on any iPhone uh, up to date with the uh, latest firmware. Uh, to be honest with you, I don't even know what the latest firmware is, so let's go check it out right now. Um, software about 13.5.1. So this will work up to this date. It's a very simple, easy click method. Um, I've researched it all over YouTube, man. I couldn't find, I was getting frustrated and I was ill, aggravated. Finally, I came across it, and nobody on YouTube had it. Nobody. They had some similar ideas and similar ways, but it didn't work to this firmware and to this iPhone 11 Pro Max. So, like I say, this may work down to the iPhone 7, 8, I don't know. May work on an or iPad, I'm sorry. I don't know. I don't own one. So, you be the judge of that, but I'm just going to tell you how to do it. It's very simple. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up Safari. And mainly the reason why I wanna do this was for YouTube. Because I was having problems with my laptop and it wouldn't work and um, that's just another story another day. But anyways, I didn't have access to a desktop feature um, to go into YouTube, so I needed to use my phone. Um, back in the day, you know, you just could click a button. Well, today I found that button. So anyways, we're gonna go in here and we're gonna click search. We're going to go to YouTube. Uh, we're going to go to the Google search. YouTube down here. Take one down. All right, it's going to pull up. And you say this is your standard iOS Safari page. Okay. You know, this is the standard what have you. The, whenever you Google uh, YouTube. So we want to use the desktop feature. So what we're going to do is from, from this page right here. See the double A up in the top left corner? Don't long press it, just tap on it. Right there. It's gonna pull this little menu up and it says it has your, you can change your font from 100% down. Uh, you can hide your toolbar. Right there, request desktop website. We can click that right there. Bam, there you go. Very simple guys, very easy to do. I don't know why someone hasn't made a video on this yet. It just blew my mind, but it's very simple. Um, in the older videos, they were telling you to long press the uh, refresh bar on the, uh, or the, the refresh circle on the top right of the uh, address bar. I tried that and tried that, and then for some odd reason, I clicked the uh, A on the left side one day, and there it was. And to be honest with you, I didn't know how I'd done it till I had to go back through and try to, to figure out how to do it again. And then I was I was long pressing and then finally I just tapped on it and it worked. So anyways, that's how you do it guys, it's very easy. And then from there you can go and click on whatever it is. There you can use your new uh, search bar, type in whatever you want. Um, you, you know, it's very simple guys. So anyways, stay tuned. I got more videos coming, uh, hit the comment or hit that like button subscribe button and uh drop a like down or drop a comment down in the in the comment section and uh, until next time guys see y'all later